IBFW Athletic Director Tommy Bell joining us now. And Tommy, um, kind of a bittersweet day, I guess, when you take a look at IPFW Athletics, but in a good way because the success that Dane Five had has kind of allowed him to take a different job. And then you've got his successor right here. Absolutely. You know, we're, we're excited for Coach Fife and his new opportunity. And, but we're also excited about the direction of IPFW basketball with Coach Jasek uh, being named our head coach today. And we know that our program is in willing and capable hands. And talk about the process of the last week because with Tony, um, you know, you hear all the rumors out there and, you know, Dane being a hot coaching commodity and things of that nature. Uh, but what was the last week like and then interviewing Tony as well getting him you know set up for this position well we actually it's been a, it's been a couple of week trip but with a number of inquiries that I had from athletic directors and other people calling direct uh, to have some discussions with Dane I kind of knew that you know the handwriting was on the wall that the opportunities really was going to present himself so we uh, started looking at two things one one if uh, coach Fife becomes a head coach do we have a whole staff defection what will our plan be or and then what happens if we have one coach leave what will our process be so with that we knew that with this plan we knew that coach Jasek was ready and uh, we knew it was in the best interest of our student athletes uh, to make him our head coach what makes him a good fit aside from the experience that he had and the knowledge that he has of these players, you know, having recruited some of them since high school or junior college? Mm -hmm. Well, one, he's got the relationships with the student athletes. Secondly, he's committed to academics just like Coach Fife was. The whole basketball staff is committed to the graduation of our student athletes. That's a big key for us. Uh, also, uh, he's got his own philosophy on his style of play of how he would like to play here, but he does know the core is going to be defense, which has been what has been our trademark for our success is playing good defense, but knows a uh, uh, that he wants to establish his own uh, tempo and style for IPFW basketball. Now, when you mentioned Dane, you mentioned that you, you kind of saw the handwriting on the wall, the interest from other schools. Um, when that starts, do you, you kind of take a put a feather in your cap, essentially, because you know the reason that people are interested is be is because of what he's built and the success he's had here in Fort Wayne? Absolutely. And uh, anytime coaches are successful, people are going to inquire uh, because all institutions are looking to have winning basketball programs, but also winning other programs uh, because success breeds success. And we knew that once he had two years uh, of success back to back in winning seasons, that people were going to inquire. And as far as you go, um, talk about uh, the other candidate. I guess you can't comment specifically on the other candidates, but when you got to Tony, what essentially, I mean, other than the experience, kind of wrapped it up for him because he seems like such a great fit and another young guy here at IPFW to take the reins of the program. Another young, yeah, of course he's a young guy, but he and I had built a relationship over the last three and a half years that I've been on campus because he's in charge of scheduling. And so we've gotten to know each other. And by doing that, I also had the insights. He was informing me of a number of things that uh, maybe Coach Fife uh, was not able to give me a heads up on, whether that's a discipline or academic progress or scheduling or you know, maybe a fundraising event that's coming up. Every area that's important for running a men's basketball program, Coach, uh, Coach Jasek was very involved in each and every area, and so that's why he was a natural choice for us. All right. Anything else you'd like to add? Uh, we're excited. It's a great day to be a Mastodon. Right. Appreciate it. Thanks, Thanks Tommy. Yeah. Thank you, buddy.